Sohill, Hill, and I'm going to talk about cell phone usage under 12. While I was preparing the speech, I thought of an idea to make it a little fun. From now on, whenever I say banana, I actually mean cell phone. So banana equals a cell phone. Why should children be allowed to have bananas? There are many reasons why a child should be allowed to have bananas. After school, if I don't see my mom, I fish my banana out of my backpack, turn it on, and give her a call. Most of the times, I find out that she's just running a couple of minutes late due to traffic or some last minute work at office. When a child is kidnapped, wouldn't it give the kidnappers a surprise when the police come knocking at their door? When children have medical situations, bananas can be very useful. Take me for example, I have asthma. So whenever I go to basketball, swimming, soccer, etc., my mom always tells me to have my banana and my emergency medicine with me at all times. Bananas give parents peace because they know their child's voice is just a dial away. Although these are great reasons why a child should have a banana, there are many reasons why a child should not have a banana. A child may abuse their privileges by texting when they are in class. Some bananas have cameras. They may take pictures when they are not supposed to. Children, some bananas also have calculators. They may use the calculators and tests and math and completely miss out on the learning experience. The banana may ring when the teacher is talking and disturb everybody's few precious minutes of class time. Fortunately, technology has gotten far enough that there is a way to solve these problems. There is a way where special bananas can be made so that you can, o you, you can only use them during school hours. The price of these bananas can be reduced significantly by taking away the unneeded accessories such as cameras, video games, etc. I think I have made a strong case here to allow children to carry bananas with them. Oops, my banana's fuzzing. I, I gotta pick it up. It's my mom. Okay, mom, I'll wait inside the temple when I am done with my speech. Thank you and have a nice day.